Hello, you guys. This is just an energy check-in for whoever needs it. Hope y'all are doing well. Let's see what's going on for the collective. What do we need to know right now? What's important that we need to know from the universe right now? So we have the Ace of Pentacles, an offer. We also have the Queen of Pentacles. So it looks like that maybe y'all are going to get an offer for some, you know, higher paying job right now. And I'm thinking that it could be something you're going to have to move for. So it looks like that some of y'all are going to have to move. This job does entail moving. But it will affect your life dramatically. You'll get a big paycheck. So that's always good. So what do we need to know for love? Seven of Pentacles. Back on the work situation. It looks like that uh, you are contemplating, would it be worth it? You know, money's not everything, y'all. Would money make you happy with the Seven of Pentacles? Now let's focus on love, Spirit. Give us something on love. I know something on love. You have the Knight of Swords, the Knight of Wands, the Eight of Cups in reverse, the Star, and the Ace of Wands. So somebody definitely wants to come in. Could be an Aquarius. Doesn't have to be with the star sign. They want a new star. They have things they want to talk to you about. Eight of Cups in reverse is, you know, at some point they have walked away from the situation. And they want to talk to you. They want to talk to you about what? What do you want to talk about with this new start? What do they want to say? Find out what they want to say. Don't walk away. Don't walk away again. Don't leave me. I need, they want you to be, you know, in a better circumstance together. They want to talk it out with you. They want to work it out. They've took some time. They hope you have too. With, you know, healing and the will of the year means that it will happen before the end of this year, which means, you know, it's going to take them some time to make this offer because they know that y'all have been in separation and they're thinking about all the things they need to say and do to reconcile this matter how do they think you feel about them how do they think you feel for them how do they think you feel for them we have the page of pinnacles that you're slow they think, you think that they're slow at making a new start. Like you waited on them forever to make a new start before, and it seems like you're still waiting on them. So, I, I think they think that you're going to reject them, the hermit. And that's also my ghosting card. You know, you've already looked at the situation. You've already thought about it. You already gave them patience. You've already waited on this situation. And frankly, you're just tired of waiting. And you feel like that if you gave them another chance, you'd still be waiting. How are they going to go about changing your mind? How? What are they going to do to change your mind? You have the world. Tell me about this world card. And the three of cups. Teamwork makes a dream work. So they think, they feel like that you need to help them do better. They want you to help them do better, collective. So, if before you were, felt like you were doing all the work, trying to make the connection stick, they want you to hold them accountable to make it work. They definitely want you to make them accountable to make this situation work between both y'all. So they definitely just want you to get on their ass if they slack. And I don't know if you're, will you do that? Will you do that collective? Will you do that? Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles and the Sun.
you think that it would be worth it. So this is kind of iffy situation. Uh, you got this person that walked away in the past. They think they made a mistake. They want to come towards you. Uh, they feel like they want to work on it. They don't know how to go about it. But one of the things that they hope that you will do is hold them accountable for slacking off with you. Like you're going to really have to hold their hand through the situation. Ace of Pentacles. They're going to hope, you know, it'll be stable with y'all. You also have, let me get this card, Queen of Wands. So, they're finding you very attractive at this time. And they're hoping that you find them attractive enough that you think it'll be worth it. They do have the stability with all the pinnacles out here. But will you hold their hand and try to make this work? Let's see the most likely outcome for the situation if you do take this offer from this person. What's the most likely outcome? What's going to go on in this situation? Most likely outcome for y'all if you do hold their hand lead them show them the way most likely outcome is the empress the shadow side and the two of swords it'll definitely help them get out of their head in the situation they're somebody's coming out of a crossroads uh, i don't know i think you're just dealing with somebody that uh has either not been in a relationship in a long time or had been in a relationship that utterly failed and they have just, they're at a loss for words or how to bring this connection together, to be honest with you. That's what I'm seeing here. So y'all have a choice what you want to do, but they feel like that it's, you know, it says Empress, it's going to be worth it in the end. But you got to stick in there with them. You got to guide this person to make it all work out, to make it all happen because they need some guidance from you. They need somebody that's going to lead the way, collective. So if you're willing to lead the way, they're definitely willing to go forward with this.